Well, hello there, my beautiful kings and queens. How y'all doing out there? Bless! You better know, you better believe it, and you showed up better a little bit. Um, I came outside, I didn't know that there was frost on the window, so while I'm sitting here waiting for my car to defrost, I said, well, let me turn this camera on and talk to God's people. My peeps, my beautiful kings and queens. How y'all doing? All right, okay. Well, anyway, mind your business. Don't even worry about my car and don't be focusing on my five head. Okay, um, seriously. The message for today is I can. Yes, I can. Anything that you know that you were meant to do, that you were purpose to do, that you have a, a unrelenting urge and desire to do. I'm not talking about nothing negative like homicide, stuff like that. But I know it's just something on the inside that has been gnawing on you and sometimes it go away, but then every now and again it comes back and you know that you need to do it, but there's some doubts or there's some fears or you may have mentioned it to some people and they're like, oh, no, uh, that's not for you. I don't think that could be done. Uh, if I were you, I wouldn't do all that negativity. <clears throat> if it's meant for you to do it, yes, you can. And even, it don't even have to necessarily apply. I can does not necessarily have to apply just on something like, you know, going back to school or whatever. Um, starting a business or whatever, you know buy the house, whatever, um, going into ministry or change your professions, whatever. But even if it's something like something that challenges you, like life be life and sometimes, and we are faced with challenges, but we should never allow doubt. We should always doubt doubt. Uh, we should not allow fear to stop us from traveling and I'm talking to myself because anybody that know me I mean I have been to some places but when it comes to the planes uh, but you know I have to overcome my fear that's when I have to do the I can I have to convince myself that I can I mean I see so many people flying all the time what's the matter with you <laughs> you know so when you need to do something to say I can you know, I can. I, and if you, for you folk who need a scripture out there, you go on over to Philippians. I can do all things through Christ who give me strength. Um, <clears throat> you can. You can. Even when you don't feel like getting up, I can. When you don't feel like going, I can. When you don't feel like going back, I can. Uh, I can. I can. Anything that you feel like you can't do, just, uh, Take the apostrophe and the T off of that, and, and I can. I can. Mm -hmm. I can overcome. I can. Whatever has held me bondage, hold me bondage any longer, because I can. If you feel like you can't get out of a tumultuous relationship, it, and it don't even have to be a tumultuous it could be a relationship that's just not for you, not right for you. I can. If you've been around someone who's constantly telling you can't, I can. Throw them back that apostrophe and that T. You had that. Because I can. All right. So you can. Whatever it is today that you have been telling yourself up until today, I can't. You can. You can go back to school. You can start that business. I don't care how old you are. I don't care how much education you got. You can. Okay? When you step out of the realms of the rules in the box, you can. It's not too late. It's, it's really not. It's not too late. It's not too late to start over. Yes, you can. So I want you to put those two words together. Apply them. I can. All right. That's just, that's the message for the day. Oh, no. I could do this. <laughs> I love you. Because I can. <laughs> Have a blessed day, y'all.